All right, Steve, thank you so much. Coming up on 618, we're live at Kalachi Cafe this morning off mm -hmm. of Western right. with Jacob Bradford. And if you get on Facebook page, remember to wish Jacob a happy birthday today, Jacob. I almost want to have my dough in here because it's so low. Okay. Huh? Hey guys, good morning. We're out here at Kalachi Cafe, standing next to Donna Garcia. And we're making the dough because that's, the bread is one of the most important things that they have going on out here. And what are we doing right now? We start off with 12 pounds of dough. Okay, do you need help? Morning. Do you need help with this? Uh, actually, it's doing okay. You doing okay? I'll quit touching it since we're weighing it. Oh, no, that's fine. <laughs> but all this right here, we have water and what is this in this Egg. One? Egg. Or egg mix and or yeast. yeast. It sounds like bread myers. But and the kolache mix, this is what makes the dough. It's a special kind of mix. Okay, and so all this needs to go. Where does this one need to go? You said earlier this that... This needs to go in the mixing bowl. Okay, so I'll take this, all three of these. And does it matter which order? Yeah, these come... We'll mix this part. All okay. the liquid will go over there. Oh, so the liquid part. goes in here. Okay, I've got it backwards. It's okay. So this goes in here. Egg. Kind of put a little water in there. To oh, is that get enough the, water? Get the rest of the egg. Okay. Got it? Got it. And now all this goes. This, all the mix. And what is it going to do once it's in here? We'll mix it up and we'll, it'll run for about 30 minutes, 25, 30 minutes. Okay. Until it all forms off the bowl. How yeah. long do you got, you guys come in here, I mean, when I said that we we're going to have to meet at 4.30 to do this live shot, you're like, oh, it's fine, because we're already in here. Right. But what time do you guys show up to start making the bread? Uh, on a normal day, we can get here at 3 o'clock. The rest of the time, we can get here at 4. When we're really busy, we get here as early as 2.30 in the morning. <laughs> I'm still in bed at 2.30. So how long does it take once it gets into here? It takes about 25 to 30 minutes. Just as long as it starts pulling off from the bowl, uh -huh. then it's ready to mix. So once it's in here, where does it go from there? It goes to the table. We do portion cups. Okay. And uh, 12 pounds of dough makes about five Five cuts of dough. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Donna. Now, when we come back, is what we'll be doing is we'll be making those cuts and actually making the different kinds of kolache. So be sure to keep watching Daybreak. Oh, well, Jacob Bradford is live this morning over at the Kolache Cafe. We're going to check in with him really quickly. Yeah, see how things are going over there, Jacob. Oh, we're over here. Hey, guys, good morning. Now, as you can see where we started earlier, the dough is starting to look a little bit like dough, right, Donna? Right. So how much longer do you think it's got? It's got to pull away from the bowl and all gather, so probably about 15 more minutes. About 15 minutes? Okay, well, let's go ahead and go through the process of once the dough's pulled out of that bowl, it's kind of, well, it doesn't look like that, does it? No, so, it's a little bit smaller. This has already had the time to rise. Okay. So what do we got to do now to it? We'll put flour down here. Okay. So you just pick up a handful? Uh-huh. Take Sorry. it off the pan. Okay. And do the other put, side? Uh-huh. All right. All right. Now what? Now you'll take it put it in there. And I'm cooking on my birthday. Do I get to eat this? Sure you do. Awesome. <laughs> then I don't mind making it. <laughs> and happy birthday. Thank you. All right, so it goes into this. Uh -huh. And now what? You'll push this press down. Pull and then pull this. Pull this top down. Is that good enough? Should be. Should be. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. Yeah, sometimes. All right, so now that it's out of the thing, what happens now? It's all proportion cut. Okay. And we pull it apart individually. Well, then I'll help you. And, and then th this is what we fill our meats with, um, any of our fillings. We also do our fruit out of this same cut here. Okay. Well, let's go ahead. We'll start doing this. And, guys, when we come back, you'll see the rest of this process as we continue making different collages. So be sure to keep watching Daybreak. Guys, back to you in the studio. All right, Jacob, thank you so much. We appreciate it. Time. And those so, rolls are to die for. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. And, and once you finish this, you can go have some kolaches with Jacob, where we find him right now uh, back out there finishing up this morning. Jacob? Hey, guys, good morning. We're out here. And take a look at this. This is where our dough was, uh, what we started with. And this is how it looks when it's finished. The dough's all pulled away and in one big spot. Exactly. One big dough thingy. But now we're going to go over here and now we're working with sausage and putting it into the 
to the kolache so that way it can bake. So do you want to go ahead and teach me how to do this so everybody can see how you guys work this morning? So put Take it in the there. jalapeno sausage and cheese. Okay. Kind of just fold it up, roll it into there. Okay. And you're doing something special for the people that are watching this morning, aren't you? Right. We're going to do a special this morning. You can buy one breakfast combo, get one at half off. So, everybody, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is done. Now let's go over here. Now this is strawberry, and this is the same kind of kolache, but you're putting fruit same into it. Same kind of mix, but we'll do fruit with it. All right, so what so do you got to do? We'll take it. What we'll, is this uh, murder this, weapon? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is our gadget that we use to, to form the, the hole where we do. So oh, okay. you can go ahead and do this if you'd like. Like that? Uh-huh. Do you do all of them? Uh-huh. Well, I guess we so. We do them all. Okay. And then... Once it's finished, how do you put this in there? We will you take a spoonful. Okay, I have strawberries. Am I doing this right? You're doing it right. Okay, cool. Then we just drop the fruit in here. Okay. There we go. And then, oh, it smells really good though. All right. Okay, you get all kinds of flavors. Done. <laughs> And cream cheese, jalapenos, anything you want, you just stick it in there. Now, you did make something special just for me to I eat. I did. What, what is it? We made bacon maple cinnamon rolls. I'm excited you. to eat it. Where's <laughs> that? <laughs> right over here. Okay. Now, I know Meredith was saying that we want to do like a tasting Tuesday since everybody just loved that wheatgrass shot that I tried. So, what, uh, it's bacon something? I uh have -huh. bacon maple. Okay. I'm going to try it out. Do you want to do it? And we do bacon maple cinnamon rolls on Fridays and Saturdays as well. It's really good. Thank you. It's really good. A little different. It's a little <laughs> different. No, but it's good. It's not like that wheat grass shop that I had. <laughs> All right, guys. So go ahead. Where are you located at? We're located at 2207 Southwestern. Next couple doors down from Orange Leaf. Everyone knows who that's uh -huh. at. So come by and see us. Um, you know, once it's all finished, how long until it takes until they're finished, ready it takes to go? 30 minutes to cook off. So 30 minutes and then they're ready to go? Yes, all right. they're good to go. Well, thank you so much, Miss Donna, for coming out here and making these for me. I'm going to eat all of it. But if you want to wake up with Jacob, be sure to find me on Facebook at Pro News 7's Jacob Bradford, or you can email me at jbradford at kvii.com, or you can email me, or I'm sorry, you can Facebook message me at Pro News 7's Jacob Bradford. Be sure to Facebook message me or email me. I'd be happy to come out and check out your business or event. Be sure to keep watching Daybreak after this.